Hey guys, this is Joey. I'm Casey. And this is our first video. Uh, it must be awkward for you guys to see our faces while we're speaking, I know. huh? I know. I, I know they imagined someone much uglier than me, but what can I say? So, we're here today to uh, show you a little bit about the new Pokemon trading figure game. Check that out right there. Mm -hmm. came out today. Well, it came out a while ago, or, but, no? like last week, but it didn't get in stores, at oh, okay. least around here so in New York. Shipped today or yeah, it just got here today, yes. So, um, basically, we, we picked up a starter pack that looks like this, only with stuff inside of it. Yeah, they don't sell you empty boxes like that. If they do, get uh, your money back. Each of those comes with a bunch of things. Uh, first off, a package that comes with uh, this right here that's a play, uh, play mat. Mm -hmm. like Two this. sides. Two sides. One's for, like for a quick game. One's for like more the full six games. on six mode with all the you know. When you get more boosters, you use that stuff. It also comes with uh, this little instruction manual. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> the uh, poster that I have hanging up right now. And the other side has a list of all the po all the Pokemon you can get in this set. Right, and it also comes with these little nifty trainer cards. Mm -hmm. Check those out. Um, I put them in plastic, right? Look at that. It looks a lot. They look a lot like uh, the the training card game. Only they're ver sideways. yeah yeah the sideways like this. They're horizontal. Um. So yeah, each each of them also came obviously with uh, figures. Um, three Pokemon in each starter pack with and uh, a trainer also. Mine came with red. Trico. Did you see that? Yeah. Uh, a Meowth. Meowth! <laughs> and Charizard. Nice. Check it. That's very cool. I like that one. And I, and I also got this one of Grodon. Now, what we didn't see, but they do sell, are also boosters of a two-pack, where you get one that you see and one mystery figure, and three packs, which have two that you see and you know what you're getting, and one more, one more mystery figure. Uh, and I believe that those also come with uh, more trainer cards. I think you get like one or two trainer cards in those sets. Okay. And the sets cost about eighteen dollars for the big starter, and the singles there were four dollars for us. Uh, and I don't know how much the, the middle ones are going to cost. Okay, so uh, we're going to do a little demo game for you. Uh huh. Uh, um, let yeah. me just explain the object of the game here. Well, this is the this is the quick play uh, yes. version of the game. By the this way, this is not utilizing everything. In fact, in this version. There are your trainer figures are not needed, and nor are those nifty cards that he mentioned. But the, the the goal is the same. The goal is just to get one of your Pokemon to your opponent's goal, and you do that by moving and battling your Pokemon on the field here. All right, I'm gonna go first, and on your first turn, you uh, every Pokemon has a movement value on them, and uh, the weaker they are, the faster they move. It turns it turns out. So they're more mobile, can get the goal, but they're not necessarily going to go head-to-head -head with anyone. So How do you tell their speed? Their speed is on the little spinny dial here. It should be next to their type, and it'll say a number ah. MPs. Okay. All MP, right? MPs, the speed? Yeah, that's their movement points. Oh, movement points. Yes, okay. not right. magic power. Oh, so, Charizard's so slow. Right, the powerful guys yeah. can barely move. In fact, on my first turn, I can't even move my Feraligator because I get minus one movement because it's my first. I go first. He'll get full movement on his turn. So I will move, and I can take them from my bench to one of the two entry points. So I'm going to take Murkrow, and I'll move him to the entry point for one movement, and then I'll move him one more space over for the uh, second point, and now it's Joey's turn. Okay, so you get three? Is that, is that what He gets three movements. Oh, okay. But I, I only use yeah, two plus I went first. So now you go. I see. Okay, so let's... And there's two entry points on each side. Uh, I'm going to move Meowth and move him right here. Alright, he moves there. I'm going to move, because he's slow, but he's a big diesel defender. I'm going to deploy my Feraligator right here to scare away stupid Meowth from thinking he can come on my left side. <laughs> and uh, that's my entire turn. Okay, uh, let's see. I'm going to... Oops. Uh, why not? I'll move Trico. One, two, three. Is that right? Yes, that's yeah. correct. He moves three. Cool. All right. Um, hmm. I can't move him. 
So the object of the game is to actually get to this, this right. space right here? Right, that's all it is. Once you do that, you win. And so, just so I have all my guys on the field, let's bring in Pikachu. But he can't actually move further, because you can't have two guys on one spot. Oh, so, that will be my turn. Okay, now, let, uh, let's say if I have uh, Charizard here, or, or someone who can move more than three times, uh, can I move past a Pokemon? You can move past your okay. own guys, yes, but you cannot land on a spot. Okay. Now, if, does this count as one spot right here? That is one, yes. Okay, cool. So, one. There you go. All right. All right, so on my turn, I will send my Pikachu. One, two. And now these next to him, I can choose to attack. And this will be our first attack, and I will choose. So, we both spin. I hold on to my guy, and you hold on to your guy with the little tab. Okay. And then spin... Wee. Okay, and the arrow. I landed on Thundershock, which is 40. Um, the way the attacks work are you can land on four different colors of attack. There's blue, purple, white, and red. Now, blue always wins. Purples then will always win anything under that. White always wins under that. And then red is just a miss, so you did nothing. Blue is always a dodge also. So since both of us rolled uh, spun a white, they're just basic attacks. Whoever did the higher power attack wins the battle. I hit Thundershock for 40. Uh oh. He hit Slam, which is 30. Pikachu wins the fight. And Jeez, it, Pikachu Diesel. Well, Thunderbolt for 100? Yeah, yeah, he does Thunderbolt. Your guy's about dodging and survival. Yeah. He's like a. And he has three movement? Well, that's it, because he has three movement, and I'm a two movement. Okay. So that's how it matches up. So your guy goes to the Pokemon Center. Uh -oh. Now, if you wanted to bring him out of the Pokemon Center, you could either A. Um, use one movement point on his next turn. He can't do it now. He has what's called wait, which means for the next turn he can't use that guy. But you know he can still use someone else. Um, but if he could move him, he could use one of his movement points to get him out of the poker center onto the bench, and then he can move him from there into the battle. Uh, but. You could also just wait for another Pokemon to get knocked into the Pokemon Center, and if someone else goes in the Pokemon Center, this guy gets knocked into the bench 